So this is our superior vena cava. And I'll tell you a little bit about the structure of it. So it, the superior vena cava is a vein, um, which means that the vein has a larger lumen, so larger in diameter. Um, the muscular wall is not as thick as an artery, so it's thinner, thinner muscular wall. Um, and the pressure is a lot lower. And because the pressure is a lot lower, what they have inside them is valves, so that um, the valves can keep the blood flowing in one direction and stops blood flowing backwards. Okay, so that's the superior vena cava. If we talk a little bit more about what where it comes from, it comes superior means it comes from the upper part of the body, and that also it feeds blood into the right atrium. Now, <clears throat> the job of the superior vena cava, the function of it is to um, is that it receives deoxygenated blood. Okay, so it picks up deoxygenated blood at the uh, body cells at the upper part of the body and it brings that deoxygenated blood back into this right atrium um, so that it can be taken off back to the lungs and you can breathe out carbon dioxide so it's got a really important job it brings back that carbon dioxide from the body cells back to the right atrium so that it can be pumped back around the system and get rid of that, that <clears throat> the waste products in, in terms of CO2 